The Milwaukee Journal Sentinel's Preps Plus is brought to you by Boston Store. Brands you love, quality and value you deserve. Buy, pick and save. New every day. By Frederick the Medical College of Wisconsin with three hospitals over 25 locations and more than 2,000 doctors. Find one close to you. Buy Robert Hack Diamonds, paying cash for gold, silver, and diamonds at Robert Hack Diamonds. Buy Bryant and Stratton College. Have a calling to help others? A career in nursing could be right for you. Learn more about careers in healthcare at bryantstratton.edu. And buy Menards. Save big money at Menards on all your home improvement needs. Hi and welcome to Preps Plus. We are at Dominican High School in Whitefish Bay, home of the Metro Classic Conference champion boys basketball team. And yes, we are back at our normal time slot after the Olympics. Hi, I'm Lance Allen from today's DMJ4. And I'm Mark Stewart, prep editor of the Milwaukee Journal Sentinel. Tonight we've got plenty of action from boys basketball regionals plus hockey sectional final highlights. <laughs> We'll start this week's show with wrestling. No, not with the mascot or you, Mark, but with a young wrestler from Milwaukee Bradley Tech who has displayed excellence on the mat as well as coming a long way in the classroom. Brad Preter, or should we say Bradley Tech Preter, mm -hmm. has the Boston Store featured student athlete. As he prepared for his third trip to the state tournament, Mohammed Fall had that nervous anticipation of a competitor with championship dreams. Excitement, adrenaline rushing, you know, all that stuff. You know, just gotta get onto it and grind through those matches. Mohammed took a record of 46 wins and four losses to Madison. It's a mark that was built through his dedication to the sport. He works out on his own, goes to the extra practices, really lives and breathes wrestling. That's what sets him apart from a good kid to a great athlete. Bradley Tech had four guys qualify for state, including Fall's workout partner, Doremus Gordon. Working with Mohammed is real tough. Like, he's on you all day. He's like, it makes me sweat hard. I lose like six to seven pounds at every practice. And like, I love drilling with him. Like, he, he pushes me. Mohammed has learned a whole lot more than just work ethic and wrestling technique while he's been here on the mat. He's also developed a great appreciation for everything that wrestling has done for him. Wrestling has done a lot for me, you know, meeting different people and, you know, so many people showing you love and caring for you and stuff like that. Meeting great people is just means a lot. Coaches, teammates and opponents have all had an influence on Mo. Teachers have been more influential for him recently as well. Not always a strong student, Mohammed began to study harder to reach a 3.8 grade point average last semester. Being part of the city, you get like a lot of distractions and stuff like that, but you know, I just found out that I had to stick to the books this year. Assistant coach Shane Canelli says people really listen to Mohammed here in the wrestling room. Mo, who's been involved in ringers and city kids wrestling, also coaches younger kids in the sport. He really goes all out, does everything he can to help others, so it's showing. It's like a karma thing. Good things happen to good people, and he's really starting to see those benefits. Fall, who didn't start wrestling until his freshman year, was proud to represent Bradley Tech and the city of Milwaukee in the state tournament. I think Milwaukee has to be has to be represented in a good way, just seeing it in a positive way. You know, so many people see it in a negative way, but there's a lot of positive things going on in the city. Bradley Tech has had the city's strongest wrestling program in recent years. This season, the Trojans won their eighth consecutive league title, thanks to guys like Muhammad Fall. He loves this sport, and we both do. And so that's, that's what make us push harder. Hard work pays off, as they say, so, you know, it would be great to see that hard work pay off. Of course, we tape these segments in advance, so by the time you're watching this, the state tournament will be over. Hopefully, it was a great experience for Muhammad. But no matter how he did in Madison, he will end his career with some hardware. Muhammad, for all you do in school and for your sport, Boston Store is proud to present you with the Preps Plus Student Athlete of the Week Award. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> 
all special order ideal garage doors are on sale at Menards. Five star doors feature a durable three layer insulated construction. Right now, this 16 by 7 door with windows is $649. AC2 pressure treated lumber resists rot and decay and is the preferred choice for outdoor projects. Now, all boards, lumber, timbers, and decking are on sale. Starting at 39 cents a linear foot for five quarter by four inch select decking. Save big money at Menards. Nurses make a real difference in people's lives. Let Bryant and Stratton College make one in your life. Receive the personal career-focused education you need to earn your nursing degree in two years or less. Learn in industry current medical labs and get practical experience in an internship. Over 88% of our nursing students pass the NCLEX RN exam. Plus, you can start your nursing education as soon as next semester. So join the many Bryant and Stratton College nursing graduates working throughout Milwaukee. To get started, call or click today. Welcome back to Dominican High School on the Milwaukee Journal Sentinels Preps Plus. Lance, the calendar has changed and March Madness is upon us. WIA Boys Basketball Regionals are underway and we have the highlights in the Bryant and Stratton College Preps Plus highlights. While the boys basketball team here at St. Francis has struggled in recent seasons, the Mariners made definite progress this year. Their opponent in this regional game, a Milwaukee North squad that features the state's leading scorer. Blue Devils junior David Hamilton came in averaging better than 32 points per game. He shoots from Cudahy to open the scoring in this one. St. Francis is led by a trio of talented seniors. This is Adam Corpella who lit it up for 29 points. Another member of that trio, Zach Scholand, connects from beyond the arc. Mariners up one after a quarter. North Division actually has a pair of big time scorers. Darrell Riley hits the three and draws the foul. Four point play. North led by three at that point, but Chase Nowak, the other member of the Mariners' big three, responds. Nowak scored 10 in the second quarter. St. Francis up three at the break. In the third, Jalen Lazenby, nice inbounds pass to Adam Corpella. Mariners by four. But David Hamilton connects from beyond the arc on back-to-back -back possessions. Blue Devils up two, headed to the fourth. Mariner defense buckles down. Marquise Harris tough on the ball. Then Jalen Lazenby steps into the passing lane and goes for the easy layup. This game would go to overtime, tied at 56. In the extra period, check out Keyshawn Boyd with the putback, North again leading. But moments later, Chase Nowak will catch and quickly fire for three. Are you kidding me? St. Francis takes a thriller, 66-63. No matter how they fare in the next round, the Mariners could take great pride in this effort. You know, for Adam, for Zach, and for Chase, I'm really proud of them. Uh, you know, Chase hit a big shot, Adam hit big free throws. Uh, these kids have really, really worked hard. I'm very proud of them. I, I, I just can't say enough for my seniors and what they've done out here tonight. They're, they're just fantastic. Brookfield Academy, co-champs of the Midwest Classic Conference, took an 18-5 record into Saturday's regional final at Dominican. The Knights are seeking their third straight Division IV state championship. The highly recruited Diamond Stone shows a soft touch on the jumper. Then Stone shows he can dish it off as well. Jack Jelasic will drop it home. Dominican leads at 23-16 at the half. As the Blue Knights try to rustle up a comeback, Ryan Clary can't connect, but older brother Sean Clary is there. Two plus the foul. The Clary's combined for more than half their team's points. Diamond Stone is tough to stop. Through traffic with a big jam as the Knights extend their lead. Brookfield Academy loves to run. There goes Josiah Marsh up and over the block attempt. You can't avoid this block. Stone chases it down. Guess what's coming? Yup, Stone throws down 32 on the night. Brookfield Academy needs some magic, but this pinpoint bomb by Joseph Lemon comes after the third quarter buzzer. Chris Topp will top things off in the fourth. Dominican gets the convincing victory and hopes the regional title is just a stepping stone. Every day at practice, we go 100%. We go all out. We're trying to be the best Dominican basketball team we could possibly be. 
and stays the next go and be trying to three feet. Mark, pretty incredible that Dominican has not one but two thousand point scores, and they're both juniors. Of course, Preps Plus will be following all the teams through the WIA tournament. That's right, and right now we've got another big regional final matchup in the Menards Game of the Week. Two rivals, one regional championship at stake Saturday in Racine between Horlick and Case. Horlick eking past Racine Park to make it to the regional championship game, while Case Cruz passed Oak Creek in their tournament opening win. The Eagles are at home and they're red hot. 15 straight wins, including a pair of victories over the Rebels. Despite their namesake, the Rebels appeared calm and confident. Well, the top-seeded Case Eagles were hoping to roll a turkey with their third win of the season over Horlick. Early on, Case senior D'Angelo Jackson asserting himself. The nice move puts Case up five. But Horlick senior Ricky Neal Jr. has an answer. A nice fadeaway jumper off the glass. A two-point game after one. Second quarter, Horlick gets hot from outside. Deontay Woods with the triple. Rebels grab a 25-23 lead. Case, though, is a deep team. Lots of guys to go to. David Clark is one of them, and he gets the foul. 29-28 Case at half. At the break, Horlick had to be the happier of the two teams, but whatever was said in the dressing room ignited Case. James Trice, a senior stepping up big. There's three of his game-high 16 points. Next trip, Malik House. Bring him up, Case up eight. Horlick trying to stem the tide and keep it close, but their fortunes turned on a dime. A turnover coming out of the timeout as Case keeps coming. Second effort here from their junior big, Darian King. Then in transition, it's Dazon Scott. A 27-10 run for Case. Eagles up 56-38. In the fourth, Horlick trying to make a run. Ricky Neal Jr. with the basket and the foul, but Keith Thompson and Case pull away to end Horlick's season. The Eagles' 15-point win crowns them regional champs and advances Racine Case to the Division I sectional semifinals Thursday night against West Dallas Central. It's going to be a really tough road, and uh, our, but our kids are going to give it everything they got, and we, we'd love to represent uh, the Racine area at State again this year. We got a good team, we're solid, and we just got to keep pushing. It started our practice, you know, and that's how I feel. We're really good. We got it. We, we're going to take it. Hockey fans, we have you covered as well. We're going to chat with one of the Milwaukee Admirals plus two local teams battle for a berth in the state tournament. And remember, for in-depth coverage of the tournament, be sure to go to JSOnline.com. Stick around. We'll be right back. Good timing is a tricky business. A bell doesn't ring when the fruit is ripe. At Pick and Save, time equals freshness. You can taste it in the produce we source, the beef we grind fresh in our stores, and in the products we bake daily. Getting the timing right. Every minute, every hour, every meal. Pick and save. New every day. Who do you trust when selling your gold, silver, and diamonds? Robert Hack Diamonds was secret shop by the media and they found out that Robert Hack Diamonds offer the most for their jewelry. At Robert Hack Diamonds, we'll treat you like family. Shop around before you sell. If we can't beat a competitor's offer on your scrap gold, we'll give you $20 just for trying. Bring your gold, I will get you some money. Robert Hack Diamonds is located at 76 and Layton in Greenfield and our newest location on the corner of Green Tree and Port Washington Road in Glendale. What would make your doctor, your everyday doctor, an extraordinary everyday doctor? Well, if they're part of Freighter and the Medical College of Wisconsin's Health Network, that's exactly what they'd be. Why? Because your doctor would be connected to the region's only academic medical center, and so would you. Renowned specialists, more treatment options, only academic medicine can offer. We have over 200 primary care doctors in more than 20 locations, so there's bound to be one close. Call to find the right doctor for you. Save $1,000 on your college tuition. The Dan Jansen Scholarship Fund, supported by Boston Soar, will award two $1,000 Preps Plus college scholarships to high school seniors from the 2014 graduating class. To fill out your Preps Plus scholarship application form, please visit www.jsonline.com slash scholarship starting now. 
Hurry, completed applications must be received by Saturday, March 15th. Zach Budish has overcome injuries throughout his hockey career. In fact, Lance, a football injury caused him to miss his final season of high school hockey. The Minnesotan is our guest as Pick and Save presents from preps to pros. Being a good teammate, I think, can, you know, can take you a long way. Um, you know, everyone uh, wants a good guy in the locker room and, you know, can help extend your career and help get you to the next level. Zach Budish has enjoyed success at many levels in hockey, including a couple of state titles even before he got to high school in Edina, Minnesota. Winning the state championship my, uh, I think it was seventh grade year, second year of Pee Wee hockey, and then uh, we won it again my eighth grade year for the Bantam. So um, that was, you know, my biggest accomplishment as a kid, and then playing in the high school state tournament. Uh, we came up a little short every year, but uh, it was a great experience to play in front of, you know, 18, 19,000 fans at the Excel Center uh, with a wild play. Budish didn't get to play hockey his senior year of high school because he tore his ACL in a playoff football game. His sophomore year at the University of Minnesota, he tore the other ACL. It was tough on me mentally to have to watch, you know, my teammates for two years. I was two out of three years, so um, a lot of time in the stands and in the gym rehabbing and you know, it taught me a lot, uh, you know, about hockey, but more so as a person and, um, you know, just learning to overcome adversity and it can, you know, make you better in the long run. Having overcome those challenges, Buddhist tries to live his life with a positive attitude. When you wake up, if you're having a, you know, you didn't get a good night's sleep or you're having a rough morning, I mean, I just remind myself how fortunate I am to be able to play hockey for a living and, um, you know, obviously it doesn't last forever, so you got to enjoy it you know, while you can. Budish followed in the footsteps of his three older brothers, all of whom played hockey. He credits his high school hockey coach and a football coach who helped with strength training with being instrumental in getting to where he is today. I think being a pro is, you know, uh, in all aspects of life, you gotta be, A, you gotta be good at what you do, whatever sport you play, and I mean, obviously that's important, but also, uh, you know, other things like giving back to the community and, um, you know, working at academics and just little things like that that all make you an all-around better person. Just like Dominican, Wisconsin Lutheran High School has a tradition of winning conference championships in boys basketball. April Boblin checks in with the Vikings' latest title-winning team as we meet our Robert Hag Diamonds Team of the Week. It's not uncommon to see a star emerge in high school sports, but the Wisconsin Lutheran boys basketball team breaks that mold with their evenly talented team. We feel like all the guys that play, if, if you're in that situation, you've got to be ready to make a play. And so, you know, from our philosophy, it, there's been no problems not having a star at all. We just go with the flow and one game it's one kid and the next game it's another kid who steps up. We don't have any superstars. We just follow our team, we can do a lot but our points come off our defense. The Vikings have utilized and will rely on their defense and athleticism to help get them to the next level. I really believe in defense, that defense really wins championships, so we need to work on our defense a little more and boxing out. Well, when we do our statistical analysis, this team has played out as our number one defensive team that we've ever had. Uh, their ability to shut down in a variety of different ways, whether it be pressing or half-court man-to-man, has just stood out as this is a team that separates themselves with their team defense. And our speed and quickness on the court are definitely our best asset, and the boys are able to utilize that on the defensive end of the court. Rich in tradition, the Wisconsin Lutheran boys basketball team has won their conference for the past nine years. They're currently ranked second in the area and are seeded number one in D2. They were disappointed last year when they didn't win the state championship, and you know, so the whole offseason they've had one thought in their mind, and that's to make it back to state and give themselves another chance to win it. Sitting at 20 and 2, the Vikings know how to run the court, but it's more than just court action that makes them a successful team. Before home games, um, my wife usually makes some dinner, and so they come over to our house and they spend some time in my house and let my kids bug them uh, until they're finally ready to go. But 
You know, that's one of the things that I learned from my dad coming in is you want to build team chemistry in, in simple little ways. And one of the ways that you can do that, of course, is get your boys to spend time together. Because I, I think it builds a bond in between us, team, and the coaches. That helps a lot. And I don't think a lot of teams do that. They take the time out to team bond. Congratulations, guys, on being the Robert Hack Diamonds Team of the Week. Yay! Stay tuned. We're going to hit the ice with WIAA playoff action. That's next on the Milwaukee Journal Sentinels Preps Plus. At the previous college that I attended, I didn't feel comfortable, I didn't feel welcomed, and I didn't feel like I had the help that I needed. I chose Bryant and Stratton College because of the small class size and the one-on-one -on -one teacher and student interaction. Before you even graduate, Career Services will set you up with interviews. I am a private charter broker. I love my job, I love how far I've come, and I couldn't have done it without the help of Bryant and Stratton College. Going to Bryant and Stratton would make a tremendous difference in anybody's life. For every product, there's a window of opportunity. The right time to catch it, cut it, pick it, and bake it. At Pick and Save, that's why we continuously stock and prepare fresh foods in our stores daily, getting the timing right. Every minute, every hour, every meal. Pick and Save, new every day. Who do you trust when buying your jewelry? Brad Gilbert here, and I can tell you at Robert Hack Diamonds, we will treat you fair and like family. We have thousands of diamonds in stock, thousands of pieces of jewelry, and prices from under $50 to over $50,000. Come to Robert Hack Diamonds for a relaxed and enjoyable jewelry buying experience. Shop around before you buy. Robert Hack Diamonds is located at 76 in Layton and Greenfield, and our new location on the corner of Green Tree and Port Washington Road in Glendale. Come to Robert Hack Diamonds. Imagine, you're diagnosed with something serious. How far would you go to find the best treatments? The best doctors? A hundred miles? A thousand? How about right in your neighborhood? With Freighter in the Medical College of Wisconsin's Health Network, renowned physicians and breakthrough treatments are practically outside your door. Three hospitals, over 25 locations, and more than 2,000 doctors all connected to the region's only academic medical center. Now what is possible is closer than ever. Call to find the right doctor for you. Update your entryway with a new Larson Storm Door from Menards. Featuring a retractable screen and Duratex surface, providing superior protection against rust. The Woodfield model is $179. The Royal Oak is $199. Add security and style with Schlag lock sets. Experience the convenience of their electronic locks and never worry about getting locked out again. The Elan keypad lever and a satin chrome finish features easy wire-free installation. $109. Save big money at Menards. Each year, millions of athletes suffer from sports-related injuries, ranging from heat stroke to strains and broken bones. Here to talk with us about injury prevention is Dr. Carol Vetter, Medical Director of the Freighter and the Medical College of Wisconsin Sports Medicine Center and Team Physician for both the U.S. Speed Skating Team and the Milwaukee Wave. Dr. Vetter, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you. People in general and even athletes may have a tendency to avoid getting an evaluation or treatment for injuries. Tell us why that's not a good idea. If you delay in getting your diagnosis, then you will delay in your return to what you want to be doing, the activities you want to be doing. So getting a good diagnosis and getting on a treatment plan will speed up your recovery and get you back to what you want to do sooner. What can athletes do to prevent an injury? So prevention really comes from strength and conditioning and being in good condition in a safe condition to be playing your sport. So if you do have an injury, getting involved in a physical therapy program will really improve your chances of getting back to what you want to do quickly and safely. All right, Dr. Vetter, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you. To learn more about the Freighter and the Medical College of Wisconsin Sports Medicine Center, visit freighter.com slash sports. The Brookfield East co-op hockey team provided a big storyline in the WIAA playoffs on the way to the sectional final. We'll see if that team known as the Stars can make it to state in the Preps Plus Spotlight. A 
trip to Madison and a chance to play for a state title. It's the Section 8 final here at Wilson Park. The team that was expected to be here was University School. They're the Classic 8 champion, and they've been state ranked throughout the season. The surprise team is Brookfield Catholic Memorial. They're the number 8 seed, but they've already won three playoff games, including a win over the top seed, Homestead. Lots of puck control for the Wildcats in the first, which resulted in eight quality shots on goal. But the Stars' J.J. Murnane was up for the challenge with a clean period, 0-0 after one. USM tallies an early goal in the second, then Brookfield with a great chance for the equalizer, but John Rimazuski is stolen by Brian Botcher. The Wildcat offense back on the attack, Watch Duncan Brown with a spinning backhand. It goes off the post and into the back of the net. The USM lead is now 2-0. Stars try to rally, the puck is loose. Justin Hill tries to stuff it in, but Botcher has it as Brookfield remains scoreless. Now it's the Wildcats with a two on one, but Murnane with not one, but two saves. Stars trail by two, heading to the third. Brookfield comes out aggressive in the final period. Here, Patrick McKnight levels Brown with the shoulder. Later on a shift change, Rimazuski with the rocket wrist shot, but it rings off the post. But Botcher was stellar all night long. Here he blocks this rebound, one of his 14 saves. He's given up just two goals so far in the playoffs. University School is state bound as they shut out the Stars 3-0. My defense has been solid all year. The team in front of me just really does a great job keeping pucks to the outside, clearing rebounds, and blocking as many shots as they can, making my job that much easier. USM hasn't been to Madison since 2010, but that was the year they claimed their second state title. They'd like a repeat performance. At this point in the season, it's not about X's and O's. It's about heart and determination and desire. So hopefully we can have more of that than the other team, but it'll be a challenge. You know, the guys in the locker room in here have been working. Really since June, uh, you know, going to the weight room and, you know, starting the beginning of the season, we've just been working all year and uh, to have it culminate in Madison is awesome. Thanks for joining us this week. Be sure to catch us next Sunday at 11 for highlights of boys sectional basketball and a whole lot more. Till then, I'm Mark Stewart. And I'm Lance Allen. See you next time on Preps Plus. Hey, can I borrow that sword? I'm kind of dangerous with this thing. <laughs> The Milwaukee Journal Sentinels Preps Plus is brought to you by Boston Store, brands you love, quality and value you deserve. Buy, pick and save, new every day. By Frederick the Medical College of Wisconsin with three hospitals over 25 locations and more than 2,000 doctors. Find one close to you. Buy Robert Hack Diamonds, paying cash for gold, silver and diamonds at Robert Hack Diamonds. Buy Bryant and Stratton College, have a calling to help others? A career in nursing could be right for you. Learn more about careers in healthcare at bryantstratton.edu. And buy Menards. Save big money at Menards on all your home improvement needs.